Welcome back to the channel. Today's day 105 of this 300 days fitness challenge. Today's exercise is right on the screen along with our daily checklist and a list of the items we're going to use until the end of this challenge. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel and pound the like button. Let's get to it. All right, let's take our first break. Uh, so last week, I started with the 20 pounder. It looks like I can do 30, I mean 25. <laughs> I can probably do 30, but I don't want to push myself there yet. Remember, I have this elbow situation going on here. So I'll put five pounds on each side and we'll go from there. 25s on each side, which actually that's what I'm going to do. Let's put 25 on each side, that weighs 25 pounds. That way I don't have to unload these ones to load the uh, dumbbells. as easy as just get them loaded. Can't wait for summer. So these weights are not ice cold. I can't even feel the heat. <laughs> Ah, Alright, that was the first set. I guess next time we do these exercises, I'll start with the 25s. Yeah. Start with the 25s and then we'll gradually add weight to it <laughs> as needed. We'll go from there. All right, so after this, we'll grab the dumbbells. The dumbbells. Uh, the dumbbells, load them up, and we'll do a ham hammer curls. And just a few more seconds on our first break. summer comes around it's gonna be hot as hell <laughs> and I'll be complaining about how much heat or how much how hot it is how much heat is in this room I'll probably have to work out with I don't know besides the door being open also fan blowing air in here it's gonna be funny it definitely it's gonna be better than this whole situation we have here. All right, time is up. Let's get back to it. Here we go.
Oof. That's what I'm talking about. All right, another break. Little break there. Um, I'm trying to think. How much weight did I put on it? When I was doing a rows last time, I think the number was 40. I wrote it down, but I don't have the notes with me. <laughs> that defeats the purpose of writing down the notes, right? All right, here we go. Let's put these aside for now. Load the dumbbells. Starting with 20 pounds on each side. So, until I put the 20 fibers on. All right. We'll do the 20 pound hammer curls. And then. We'll go with the chin-ups. Uh, maybe for next week. Or next week, next time. I don't know where I'm gonna be. I need to bring my notes for sure. But anyway. I'll be adding weight to this. Hopefully. Soon. Here we go. And again, since we're saving time. We'll do this hammer curls. Both at the same time. Here we go. pounds is the number for now. I can't add it more to that. I felt just right. Whew. Yep. So what I'm going to do is I'll finish one more set of the curls. And while the time is ticking on the rest for the bar, I'm 
I'm going to put some of that to the Z barbell so I can do rows. I could do barbell, I mean dumbbell rows, but at the same time, why not? <laughs> I don't know, I'm, now I'm deciding which ones, either with the Z barbell or, or with the dumbbells. Either way, rows are rows, right? Alright, alright. Time's still ticking. Let's have a sip. yesterday the exercise oh yeah that was my chest <laughs> <laughs> the exercise is not as strength demanding as this one or is it that my body is more adjusted to working out my chest than what it is working out my biceps my biceps, they feel like they're stretching skin. <sighs> Yesterday's exercise, I felt it as I was working out, but today not so much. This one, I'm gonna feel for a couple of days because I still, yesterday was still feeling my arms being sore from the bicep exercise as I was doing last time on day 100 yeah or no day 101 yeah all right time is up let's get back to it here we go why I'm still taking and I'm 
I'm almost done here playing around with it. <laughs> with the weight. <laughs> uh. gloves on and I should probably try with the hooks see how it feels doing chin-ups with the hooks I'll try that another day <laughs> I'll keep them with the gloves and we are like halfway through our exercise can you believe that almost halfway. All right. Just a couple more seconds. And our whatever number break this is. Whew. Sorry about yesterday's video. It was very long. <laughs> but anyway, time's up. Let's get back to it. Here we go. Put the hooks on. <laughs> uh. My hope is to be able to be strong enough to stay on the bar. <sighs> someday. For sure, someday. <laughs> and as I was saying, sorry about yesterday's long video. Looks like the videos are gonna be this long. At least 30 minutes long. Whew. Yep. It went from being barely 10 minutes to 15 to 20 some minutes. Some videos were 16, 16 minutes. And then jump from there all the way to almost 40. <laughs> almost 40 minutes long. That's the actual workout, that's it. Now I have to definitely be more efficient at editing. It doesn't. Oh, the videos are bigger. Because the bigger the file, the more my little computer takes to <laughs> work all them files in rendering and then uploading. Everything takes like two or three times as long. All right, just a few more seconds to go. set we'll do, we'll do pull-ups 
guess. Wide grip pull-ups. Uh, and then we'll do the rows. And we'll call it a day. Uh, well, too late now for me to do the hooks on. Alright. Time is up. Here we go. Easier than pull-ups. I didn't even make, I didn't even make it to ten on the last set. And at three minutes. That break was definitely three minutes. Would have made a difference if I would have taken four minutes, just a little bit. A little bit more of a difference. Cause it's not that hot. <sighs> I mean temperature helps you a little bit to cool off. And then it's freezing in here. So I wasn't that warm or that hot when I did that second set. <sighs> okay. Seems like I'm gonna do the hooks for two reasons. Reason number one being that I need to stay on the bar. Reason number two is so I can do more pull-ups. I'm gonna be tired. I don't think I can do Definitely try. I'm gonna try doing as many pull-ups as I possibly can. <sighs> eh, I should have taken my watch off. <laughs> uh, well, it's there. Uh, it looks back to me. Up, oh, Instagram. Yeah, if you're not following me on Instagram, which information is right there in this corner. Follow me on Instagram, on Facebook, and Twitter. Uh, I don't have much time to catch up, but if you have any questions, shoot them. I'll read all your comments and questions. I'll be happy to answer. All right, just a few more seconds to go. We'll go right back to it. Which bar should be there? Alright. Yeah. Alright, time's up. Here we go. Definitely getting tired. As I said, I didn't think I was gonna make it to 10 pull-ups there. I 
one as far as that's my upper body let me <laughs> even with the hooks but going to failure is definitely the plan Whew. hopefully I can do more than five pull-ups next set <sighs> things are standing I'm not sure if I'll be here for tomorrow's exercise which it is a disappointment because I definitely need to do tomorrow's exercise here especially since even though in Pennsylvania everything is open now again supposedly uh, some hotels, they still have their fitness rooms closed. I'm guessing for liability reasons. <sighs> hotels don't make money out of their fitness room. So they don't need to keep it open. <laughs> they don't need to keep the doors open. Whew. Now gyms on the other hand, yeah, but I don't have gym memberships. Plus, uh, there are just a handful of gyms that open 24 hours and who knows where those gyms are how far they are related to uh, in comparison to our the hotels where we stay so it is definitely inconvenient to just go from the hotel to whatever the 24 hour gym is it's it's unnecessary money in my book then you waste time going to the gym, spend time at the gym, and a lot of gyms you can't record it. They will not allow you to. And then all the way back from the gym back to the hotel. Yeah, it's too much. It's too much for me. <laughs> uh, I know it's it's worth for some people. To leave whatever they have behind and go to the gym and it's like escape for them it used to be escape for me too well it's kind of still is escape for me to so just focus on me <sighs> being away from the world but then go back and, uh, my world is pretty good right now I have my two biggest reasons to get back into to get back into shape. Those two big reasons are on the other side of that wall right now. All right, let's talk in more doing. Sounds like I'm losing breath. All right, here we go. times to get back up <laughs> definitely could not go back up all right time sticking two more breaks we'll call it a day Heart rate is barely above 90, which means I'm doing some type of physical activity, but it's definitely not a cardio. <laughs> uh, I will say about 10 more bits per minute will be considered a cardio. But then I'll have to do that for longer than that. Uh, 
All right, we're going back to the rows. Do some rows. Then after the rows, that'll be it. And uh, working out every day is definitely, I've definitely lost weight even though I haven't, changed, I haven't actually been in a diet. <laughs> On day 101, I weigh myself. And uh, compared to, I forgot what it was, but it was in December when I weighed myself last I was 193 pounds actually no 191 pounds and on day 101 was 183 I think it's 173 where I'm supposed to be However, whenever I get there to 173, we'll assess and see if I still need to lose fat to look how I want to look like. <laughs> if I still need to lose some fat, we'll go for there. We'll go from there. If not, so if 173 is the number, we'll definitely see it then. I might have to not just eat the same way I've been eating, I probably have to eat a little more. <laughs> it seems like I'm losing weight fast. Not too fast. Uh, that was 30, maybe 30 days. 30 days, eight pounds. That's not too fast. All right. 30 days, four weeks. Uh, all right, that's like two pounds per week. I don't know if that's too fast. Uh, probably have to do a research on that. But anyway, time's up. Let's do this rose. This is heavier than what I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> oh. 40 pounds on each side. Here we go. Definitely heavy. I know it's not too heavy, but let's put the camera a little bit down. Uh, I know it's not too heavy, but my muscles are tired by now. If it was summertime, I'll be covered in sweat by now. <laughs> yeah, you could probably see more vascularity than this, which you probably can't see anything. You can barely see my veins, but just because they're blue or green, whatever color it is. This is our last break. We'll do another set of rows and call it a day. Finally, at the end of the tunnel. Whew. I'll have to make a couple phone calls after this. Alright, alright, time's 
still ticking. And oh, I drank most of my water already. But here we go. We'll get more water. Alrighty. In the fridge for tomorrow. Alright, few more seconds to go on our very last break. Ah, oh, man, I probably have to make some phone calls so I can stay home for tomorrow's exercise. But if I make the phone call, it's not gonna be just tomorrow's exercise, it's gonna be every exercise from this point on for at least the next 30 days. Which is worth it, in my opinion. You got to make the decision. Ah, it's 40 pounds on this bell, on this little barbell. Let's see if we can make it. For some reason, this 40 pounds <laughs> didn't want to come off the ground when I was trying to move him to this side. <laughs> It feels heavier than last week. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, well, I know why. Because uh, this exercise was towards the beginning of the exercise. Of the... Uh, of last time. Now it's at the very end after I've been doing curls, chin-ups, pull-ups. <laughs> it's like the very last thing. This is getting the last bit of energy I have. All right. Time is up. Here we go. That's a good one. That's it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Adios.